Hey everybody, I'm going to do a follow-up video on my last one. Um, it seems that I've been doing a lot of videos on painting edges. It seems to be a pastime of mine. Um, I got this really great question from a subscriber who had asked me, when I'm sanding down the edges of a piece, so I'll give you an example, when I'm sanding down these edges and I already have resin on top, what happens to the resin edge once it's sanded because it all becomes scratchy. So I'll show you an example of what he means. Here is a very large piece. Now as you can see, there's a quarter inch of resin that is here on top of the wood. I've sanded the whole piece down, but you can see that the resin is still scratchy and gray. Don't worry about that. It's very common. It's super easy to fix. I don't like resining the sides of my pieces, I always paint them, but there is a trick to um, fixing the gray on the resin. Take your paintbrush and take a product like polyacrylic or better yet, just mix a thimble amount or um, I have these really great little cups from the dollar store. These little tiny shot glasses, mix like half of that of resin pre-mix it and then with your brush just very lightly brush that resin or polyacrylic or varnish right on top of the epoxy that you have sanded already. If you keep your uh, layer nice and even it will dry clear and you won't have that um, cloudy scratchy look anymore and once that's done then you just paint your edges black or white or whatever you uh, see fit for your piece. And that's it. Simple, easy. Um, there is another way of doing it that when you sand, it doesn't affect the resin. And that I had mentioned in a previous video is called doming. So instead of putting a tape barrier up on the edges of your pieces, you bring the resin with a chopstick or uh, a tongue dispenser I use. Again, these small little sticks I bought at the dollar store. You bring your resin to the just to the edge you do not let it go past the edge and when that dries it'll create a very slight beveled edge when you sand the sides it will not touch that beveled edge it's 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 perfect so there you go depending on what kind of sanding and what kind of resin and how you apply it those are the two tricks that um, i'm letting you know regarding that great question that i got on youtube all right have a great afternoon everybody